So instead of going to 400,000 people, your naked video only got sent to... How long till they come? Any minute. Are you excited? Yeah. I think Sophie's going to be a bit nervous though. I think Coco's going to be so funny. She's going to be hilarious. Let mummy wipe your face. No, I'm not, argue I'm not arguing with you. It's fine. Fine. You don't want to wipe your face? <gasps> Somebody's at the door. Someone, it's okay, it's okay, let's not make her scared. Someone's at the door to see you guys. Oh, who is that? I'm looking for a Chloe and a Sophie. Is there a Chloe and a Sophie? That's you. Do you know someone called Father Christmas? Yeah. Santa, do you know him? Well, he sent me on a very special mission to see if you're on the nice list. Do you think you're on the nice list, girls? Yeah. Are you on the good list, are you? Is everything crossed? Yeah, we're crossing fingers. We, okay. Say you all! Chloe and Sophie! Yeah! Yeah! Uh-oh, did you get it all over mummy's bed? Uh-oh, but that's okay because you're still on the nice list. Well done! Jingle bells, jingle bells, jingle all the way. Thank you so bye. much. Bye. 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 Let's talk about this on the bed. This makeup. Who did it? I it, um, Bobby. No, you said Who did it? Sophie. Sophie? Yeah. Who did the elf say did it? Elf is saying no makeup. Says Santa knows that you did that. Oh, do you think Santa will be. Oh, you don't want. You don't want Santa to know. Should we tell Santa about this? Okay. But not going to do it anymore, are you? Can you help me take these bed sheets off so I can wash the makeup off, please? Of course I can. Oh. Thank you so much. What's this? What's that? Pen. Well, who's done the pen? Sophie did. Why is it always Sophie that's done it? <laughs> it's like these kids don't want us to have nice things. Get up. Get up. Come on, get up, Mum. Come on, get up. No. Go on. No. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Listen to how she laughs. Wait. <laughs> when you. <laughs> <laughs> She's trying not to do the laugh, the cackle. Is this because you're embarrassed because you remember what happened? Is it all flooding back? It's all flooding back to you now. What happened to you? So, an embarrassment of it. Guys, Sophie nearly leaked. No, she didn't nearly, she did. Yeah, she leaked. A picture. And it wasn't a picture, it was a video. A video of you naked yeah. on Casey's Instagram. Hold up, wait a minute. Yeah, yeah. And you've. Sophie nearly leaked the video of you naked on Casey's Instagram. Out of everyone's Instagrams, who has the most followers and the most like. Alright, don't rub it in. This is the feeling of, of how sick I felt because out of everyone's Instagrams, Casey's, who all her followers seem to watch her story. So basically, Sophie had my old phone and um, she was in next to mum and she was just like. Yeah, oh yeah, we need to have my Instagram. So obviously it was the morning and she had woken up and she got into yeah. my bed and because she had this phone she was always just like watching her YouTube and stuff. So I sleep in just knickers, like so she joined the bedroom. <laughs> then mum comes like rushing in my room, wakes me up, she's like So Sophie was like filming and then she actually sent to those people. She was on my Instagram and she was like she was like, well she was doing a video and then she was doing it and then like filming it and sent to those people. I was like, Mum, just get to the point, like you literally woke me up and I'm like my heart's going like this and she was like well basically i was laying next to her and i didn't have a top on so i don't know if like people have seen it and i was like oh my gosh i've started unsending all these videos to people some because she sent them some uh, she sent, sent privately to everyone. everyone you can watch that video once and then replay it but like she sent it to those people so i was deleting it and like some people i was like oh what was it and they're like oh just sophie singing so i was like oh okay 
but it's fine. And then, um, so then yeah, so I you asked told me, oh, it's fine. You was like, oh, it's fine. Yeah. yeah. Don't worry, you wasn't in it. So I'm like, phew. So I'm about to carry on my day as normal. And then, I get dressed, just so you know. And then I'm just on my Instagram, and then I see on my story, I'm like, hi. I've not posted on my story. I go on my story, and luckily it was like the close friends only story. And it was just a video of Sophie, so I'm like, oh, okay, she's just talking. Then she goes like this, and the mum is just laying there, absolute everything out. <laughs> And I was like, oh, and then um, there was only like three people had seen it, so I was like, well, people still seen it, so I quickly deleted it. Wait, well, like, didn't Ava's sister ring you and tell you? No, no, so it's basically three people seen it. One was Louisa, Ava's sister, and then like, two other girls that I know. Then I rang Ava's sister and I was like, did you see that? And stuff, and she was like, yeah. And then she was like, but on the one that Sophie sent to people, it was only at the side that you couldn't actually see. But on the story is when you could see it. And then the two other girls, like one of them, because it was right at the end, one of the girls said, oh, she didn't realise that she skipped past it. And then the second girl said she thought it was a beige top. Definitely didn't though. Honestly, I actually felt sick. I was laughing with like that nervousness laugh that I do, that when in awkward situations, like it was the worst feeling ever. Can you say how lucky you are that she, somehow she posted it to close friends only? It literally felt in the next year. So instead of going to 400,000 people, your naked video only got sent to a few people. Yeah. God, of all the people that I thought. And guys, I hadn't even brushed my hair yet. It was morning. Oh. <laughs> God, no, I'm joking. I'm laughing now, but honestly, this morning when it happened, like my heart was pounding. I felt yes. sick. I was like, yes. oh my gosh. I was on a meeting as well, on a Zoom meeting, and then you came in, and you were like, and I muted it, and then you told me, and I was just like, oh my god. Yeah. <gasps> what are you doing? actually very good you only spilled a tiny bit Grace, you got a delivery. It's here. Yes, finally. Fish tank. Okay, let's carry it. Grace has been waiting for ages for this to come. It's finally here. And no, she's not getting fish, but this is actually for Millie, her hamster. She's building her a new home. This is gonna be awesome. Well, we haven't shown Millie in ages. Hello, Millie. I got this, well, Roland built me this cage when we first got Millie and it's all the requirement and everything but it takes ages to clean because it's got like an underneath bit and all that but, and it takes me like half an hour to an hour to clean. Now, so I also wanted to get something quite big for her. Even though this is quite big, I wanted to get something even bigger for her to like have loads of toys and stuff. So I thought a fish tank would be such a good idea to use because I've seen so many people use them. And this one's like 100 centimeters that way and then something that way but it's like over the requirements so much and it, it'll look so much nicer as well so it means basically millie's gonna have a mansion or like this is my hand compared to it like literally it's massive first i'm gonna clean it with like a clean safe pump stuff or stuff i don't think i've ever seen grace doing cleaning before like by her own choice so she must really love millie <laughs> So I've got the cleaning cozy because I know that's like the best one to use for hamsters. And I'm going to put loads of that in because then she can have loads of borrowing space. This is going to be satisfying. It's not very satisfying, is it? 
Well, that's a big that's bit. That's it. Guys. What? What? Um, I can't find my phone. The last time I had it, when yeah. I scooped up all the bedding and put it in the washing machine. And you turned the wash on? <laughs> so it might be in the wash. I Are you joking? It. No, I'm dead <gasps> serious. Well, you'll know because you'll hear it. Oh my god. <gasps> you can't open it? Look. Wait, it stopped. No, How long has it not. got? An hour and 42 minutes. I put it on for a longer wash as well. Wait, let me call it and see if it's in there. It's not ringing, it's probably broke. Welcome to the e It's just going straight to voicemail. <gasps> it's in. It's in there. You oh can hear no. it. It's in, which? It's in. Can you hear it? Yeah. But if it's ringing, it means it's still working. No, because I've just put it on. There's still a, uh, an hour and 40 minutes left. Is this your way of trying to just get a new phone? No, I, I just got my case on the case he got me as well. Oh no. What, your Louis Vuitton case? Yeah. But my Louis Vuitton wallet's been through the wash loads of times and it was absolutely fine. Right, so guys, we're going to have to wait an hour and 30 minutes. 38. 38 minutes um, to see what happens. Eight minutes, that eight minutes makes a difference. So stay tuned to see oh if my, my phone gosh. makes it. So I put it all here and then she's got like a big borrowing space up here. And then there's like, it's thinner here but she can still borrow. I have loads of stuff to put in and I'll put that all in now. So I've got everything wooden so it's like a natural thing. So I've got a wheel. I've got three houses. I've got these two little ones. They're like little village houses. And then this one's like double house it's got like underneath and then you can go up the steps on top and i've also got a water bottle that stands up and then uh, these bowls came as free i might use my other ones because these ones are quite small i'll see when they're in there how big they are like with the, her food and water i've also got her in a salt course these are quite cool because you can like literally do anything on them i've also got her a play pen because i get her out in this when i get her out i like put her in it and i put all her toys in it and the other day I got her out and I was just holding her and putting her in this. And that goes like across my whole room basically. One of our houses here. It's like a little village. Yeah. Okay, because you need three houses. Of course, we all need three houses. Yeah, living that rich life, you know. <laughs> the um, most bougie little hamster you'll ever meet. I'm not going to put this one in anymore because she has three and they're literally all the same. And I have a little mm. jar as well that I can put in. Like a little clear one for her to hide in as well. You put this one like, I've seen people put it inside so she can like crawl. Does that make sense? Like, yeah, that looks cool. Crawl in. These are for her to chew, for her to like roll down her teeth without filing them down <laughs> it looks so much nicer already like i put her food and water bowl in i need to put her sand bath but i haven't got a carrier bag so i need to do that but i'm thinking it looks so nice this is salt course we're not going to put it in because it's going to be too big so i'll keep it for when i get her on her play pen because otherwise it'll be too crowded and then her sand bath will just go here so i've put her sand in and it looks so nice i need to put the jar in i'll I don't know where to pull it, but I'll put that in and I'll, I need to put her in. Hello, Millie. You're going to go over to your new home. I'm going to put her in her new house now. She's just exploring it all. I have put some of her, I've got her used to like there. Well, I've got her used to everything before. Like I put it in her playpen and some of it in her cage. So she knows she has got used to some of it. There, but I'll put it underneath and then she can go in there. That looks so cool. You're gonna be so happy. It's like, it's massive and it's got so many things you can play with. Hello? So I found my phone. <laughs> what do you mean, it was in the washing machine? No. But I heard it in the washing machine. It was in the day washing. So obviously I had taken down the wash, the sheets and then I'd scooped up some of Chloe's clothes at the same time. So I'd actually put in, so in the cupboard next to the washing machine is the dirty washing and that's where it was. I found it, but that's good. No, it is good, but- that's Why are you so, looking at me like that? Why because I thought, I heard it in there, so obviously I felt like it was in there, but it was just next to it. Yeah, I'm so glad it's not. So obviously today's video hasn't been very Christmassy, but there's not really been a lot of Christmassy stuff going on in our house. Now everyone's in tier four. I know it sucks so much, especially for people that were relying on seeing family this Christmas to actually have a good Christmas. Yeah, I know everyone I know was, that sucks. Everyone was really looking forward to having Christmas with their families so that it gave them something to 
you know, end the year with positive. But as hard as it is, let's all try and stay positive and be thankful that the people we do have around us, check in on them, just give them a call, Zoom, you know, anything you can, just, just... Yeah, I suppose times like this that we really just need to kind of like count our blessings and look for things that we didn't even see before that we have to be thankful for. So yeah. that's what we're going to be doing. And, and, do, uh, and also, little top tip, what we have decided to do, haven't we, with your family, we are going to try and do a Christmas in April. Yeah, we've actually decided with all my family, well, providing what happens in April, but we're going to yeah. try and aim to have like our Christmas day in April. Yeah. Your mum's even promised to put the tree up for us. Okay, so. good. So guys, I hope you all have a Merry Christmas and the best Christmas that you possibly can have this year. Try and keep your spirits up and we will see you guys again in the new year. In the new year. So see you soon. Bye. Bye.